Hello and welcome to episode 32 of Youth Squad Legends. We are nearing the end of February. Let's do a squad report. Right, I'm going to try and do this without any mistakes. Which will be interesting. I'm going to do it in one take. Weatherton Fernando da Silva, overall of 62. Lanre Oyabanjo, overall of 65, gone up by one. Brees Roof, overall of 64. Gaidris Alauskis, overall of 70, gone up by 3. Yarko Hermar, overall of 61, gone up by 1. Pedro Min... Oh, there we go. That, that was the mistake. Pedro Bastos, overall of 61, gone up by 4. Jose Demenzes, overall of 64, gone up by 2. Santa Puri, overall of 70, gone up by 1. Michael Fenton, overall of 63, gone up by 1. Hernan Mastriani, overall of 70, gone up by 2. Kwame Cresswell, overall of 62, gone up by 1. Nicholas Ayala, overall of 68, gone up by 3. Lucas Jennings, overall of 56, gone up by 2. Kyle Yakovich, overall of 63, gone up by 2. No Simmons, overall of 66, gone up by 2. Miles Smith, overall of 64, gone up by 3. Ronald Chavez, overall of 67, gone up by 2. Nathan Lang, overall of 54, gone up by 1. Sam Gale, overall of 61, gone up by 1. Victor Caterino, overall of 57. Lorenzo Rios, overall of 62, gone up by 2. Corto, overall of 63, gone up by 3. Jack Aikens, overall of 66, gone up by 3. Alexandre Azevedo, overall of 64, gone up by 3. Lucas Fernando da Silva, overall of 62. Harry Coates, overall of 50. And we are done. Yes. York City against Doncaster Rovers. It's a very special moment. Corto is back. Playing football where he belongs, not on the sidelines, injured. Headache, headache, Bastos, yes. Here's Ayala, Corto, really nice to see him back. That's a good pass as well. Azevedo, oh my god. I'm done, I'm fucking done. This guy's a one man machine at the moment. You give him the ball, he shoots, he scores. That is crazy. Shall I say goal of the season right now? Because it probably is. First time shot, 25 yards out, if not more. Keeper's got no chance, it's top corner. Oh, ha. wow. Out of nowhere yet again. Ball over the top. And then crossed in with some pace. 1-1. One, one. The stunner by Azevedo cancelled out. Okay, I will take that 1-1. One, one. Boncaster, a very good side. Definitely on the borderline of League One and Championship. It was a good tester for us and we drew with them. Demenzes is out for four weeks with a sprained knee and it comes at a bad time for him personally because Azevedo is playing so well. He might come back and realise that his first team place is no more. York City against Gillingham. Caterinho. What a ball. What a ball. Got a bit of outside curl on that as well. Chavez with a shot but the goalkeeper... Once again, saves his defence. Gale. Oh, he doesn't find someone with the first effort. The second effort's off the bar. Rios. Oh, another corner. Wow. What an exciting game that was. I'm sorry that there's not going to be like any of that to like put into the edit except the chance at the end of the first half Bristol City against York City third game this episode there's Fernando da Silva Chavez chance back to Fernando da Silva maybe oh man the bounce just didn't favour us Azevedo Ayala 
Fernando de Silva on side, pokes it, not home, just wide. Fuck's sake, Roof, keep going, lad. Oh, what a challenge! The right back playing a makeshift centre back this game because of fixture congestion yet again. Azevedo finds Gale. This is a chance. Azevedo with a little flick. Puri has an attempt. Oh, we scored! We've put it in! Azevedo with the header. Another goal for the kid. It is 1-0 with only a few minutes remaining. Full time. That was it. The last chance of the game fell to us. We scored and we win it 1-0. Yet another injury problem. Chavez is out with a sprained ankle for three weeks. Our first monthly scouting updates are here. We need a good centre-back. Nothing in Serbia. The best one is Mika Hovarth. Overall of 37 to 51 potential of 64 to 88. He will not reach the 88 potential. So there's no point of keeping him. From Germany, there are three people on this list. A 92, but he's a centre mid. What is going on? We'll sign him up anyway. Since we have the money. England, our last hope. There are four people on this list. Blythe is crap, Brayford is crap, Moore is okay but he's a centre mid and Goodwin is crap and a goalkeeper. A total of 10 players and none of them were even remotely good centre backs. What you guys don't know is that I've recorded episode 31 and 32 together and I'm getting very tired now. This is going to be the last game of this episode. And I really want it to be a good game because I've had a really nice time recording it. York City against Swindon Town. Smith. Let's get off to a rip-roaring start here. Fenton. All alone. He had to do something better than that. He could still do. He has. That is another defensive mistake that I've capitalised on. And something for EA to work on in FIFA 15. Oh, ball Fenton. Mastriani. Yes, put in the rebound. 2-0. We're not even halfway through the game. I want more. The team wants more. We want to end on something very special. Oh, ball. And Mastriani's control is as good as the delivery. Oh, Fenton went with the diving header. Oh, fuck Niall Ranger, man. He's not been in the game at all. And yet, oh, the bounce goes straight back to him. I wouldn't mind if it were anybody else in a Swindon Town shirt. Full time. York City 2. Swindon Town won. It wasn't very special, but it's a win. This is the league table as it stands. We are in fourth place with 66 points, only seven points away from top now. We have closed the gap considerably. This has been Cutsy. Thank you for watching. If you've enjoyed the video, please give it a like. And I will see you next time.